Brian, thank you. Yesterday's snow and cold temperatures creating treacherous driving conditions for thousands across the state. An Owasso Pizza Place says one of their delivery drivers was put at risk after someone called in a fake delivery order for 140 bucks. TV5's James Felton talked with the shop's owner and he has a message for the person who placed that fake order. Pretty ticked off. That's how Mike Blaha felt when he realized a $140 order went down the drain. He owns Chip's Place in Owasso. Blaha tells us the order was called in around 3.30 Monday afternoon by a man claiming to be at an address 10 blocks away. Three extra large 16-inch pizzas with multiple toppings and three large deluxe nachos with loaded to the gills. Turns out people were at the home, but they hadn't ordered anything. Blaha wasn't upset about the lost money. He was irritated because his real customers had to wait longer to get their food. It's not the first time it's ever happened to us, but to this degree and the weather the way it was, you know, I mean, it just, it was really disappointing. Now Blaha says when it comes to taking deliveries over the phone, things are going to be different. For a larger delivery, um, we'll say $80 or above, we're going to ask for a credit card to be pre-authorized before we even deliver it. Now, if the customer wants to pay cash when it gets there, we will gladly void the credit card off. And, and, uh, and uh, that way, we, we know that if it ends up being a fake, next time we're at least going to get paid for it. Blaha is quick to point out his delivery driver wanted to go out in the snowy weather Monday. He tells us he doesn't know who the fake caller is yet, but he's getting close to finding out. Blaha has a message for him. Please come forward. You know, I, I'm, I'm a pretty easygoing guy. I just wanted to get this taken care of. Reporting in Shiawassee County, James Felton, WNEM, TV5. Blaha tells us after the food was brought back, he gave it away to other customers at the restaurant.